All right, people, welcome back to some more Daily Duels. So, of course, today is Tuesday. That means that we are using the Teller Knights. Yes, the, the nice and meaty, nice and powerful Teller Knights. You know, the, the power creep is kind of real. You know, Diamond, they actually put up a fight against, you know, Cleese and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, Burning Abyss. So, this might be interesting. I would, I would love for the deck to come back. You know, with the, you know, with, maybe with Star Seraphs coming up. Maybe, maybe, you know, maybe we can see something. That would be interesting. No, yeah. I would love to see uh, that deck actually, you know, pull something off. That would be awesome. Yeah. All right. So, uh, yeah, I'm thinking about just taking the duel slow. Maybe, maybe just go into you no. Know, I'm thinking about maybe just summoning uh, Altair attacking. You know, just summon Altair attacking and setting the Sky Bridge. I think that's totally fine. You know, take the duel slow. I really don't feel like, you know, overextending. So this is my last day of freedom, people. Now, I'm recording this on Monday. I will be going back into class on, uh, on the Tuesdays. So, yep. So, well, at least we can get back to, you know, me commentating about my day. Uh, I don't have as many as classes. I, I have two online classes and two in-classes. So, uh, my two in-classes are, uh, um, calculus three, yeah, you know, past calculus two, calculus three, same teacher. Uh, it's on uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays at nine o'clock, so kind of early in the morning for calculus, don't you think? But uh, yeah, Tuesdays and Thursdays. Okay, so you're gonna return her to the hand and then summon a. Uh... So he's doing dancer, noble beast. But, you know, uh... The spirit beast that like okay. So he summoned his pedophin to summon uh her. So he's got his time on, alright. I could just return to hand, you know what? No, I'm gonna go ahead and play it. So we'll go ahead and tag out. I can't believe I actually did a video talking about how I don't like Skybridge and now I'm I'm running triple Skybridge. <laughs> That's funny, huh? It's like, ah, oh, fuck Skybridge. You know, the competitive decks don't run it, then I'm not gonna run it. And I'm like, yeah, Skybridge. <laughs> not bad. Ow. I wonder if it's that freaking uh, that one card. Oh, Phoenix Chain. That would have been nice last turn, but I'll take it. You know, have fun with that with uh, Triv. Alright, so we'll go ahead and summon Vega. Activate Vega. No, I don't want Kage. I'm saying you got that one card that destroys my monsters. You'd only destroy one, right? Summon back to Neb. Now I can get your search on. Give me another uh, Altair. All right. So if I go into Triv, and he tags out, what do you do? Blah 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 blah. Turn your person on your tennis card to the extra deck and target one of your banished and one of the graveyard, and then summon them. And then I return them to the hand. He would get them back to the hand. So that would suck. <laughs> that would definitely suck if he got them back, but. You know, Deltaros can't handle this situation. I mean, he can. Deltaros can handle this situation, actually. I go into Deltaros. He can't respond to my summon. Deltaros effect. If I target him, he's going to get out of the way. And then I can just kill his... Or would it be better? You know what? It's better to Triv, actually. It's Triv. Triv time. It's better to Triv. You know, chain your... Uh... Apollo, Apollo, Apollyon, or uh, Ape Lion? <laughs> yeah. And everything go back, and then we'll go ahead and hopefully pick out something that I want out of his hand. Oh, that's just a survival card. <sighs> and uh, set the Phoenix Chain, and go ahead and poke him for twenty one. Go ahead. I mean, this chain is nice because I can go into Triv and then Triv can return everything, so it's not that bad. 
Yep, he got the old man. Alright, so I'll see that. Yep, another divine win. Yep, summoning her again. So, Divine Wind Dancer. That's pretty. That's a pretty interesting play, I must admit. I must admit. I probably should have seen this Chain of Dancer now that I think about it. Yeah, I should have seen this Chain of Dancer. I fucked up. I fucked up. I should have returned. I should have seen this Chain of Dancer. Damn it. God damn it. I should have fucking should have got the dancer. If I would have got the dancer, he would just normal summon. I would finish the dancer, and the play would have been done. But I fucked up. So, yep. So, here's my punishment for fucking up. I misplayed. I mean, I could go into another one, but it's just like, god damn it, I fucked up. Summon. So, Vega, yes, no, Vega summon Altair, like I fucked up, Daniel fucked up, he did a bad job, he is so bad, summon you, go ahead and get my search on, go ahead and give me another Altair, so yep, I have Calculus 3, and then right after that I have, um, Some new again, trip again, return everything. Go ahead and pick something out of his hand. Yay, I got rid of Dancer. <laughs> I like that. Got rid of that Dancer. Alright, I seriously need to pay attention. I put Diamond in here, but clearly this isn't the duel for Diamond. I said Diamond is so situational, but when he, when he gets against them dark decks, he fucks them up, but, you know. Mm-hmm. Okay, you got another dancer? Dancing, dancing, dancing! Like, no, hold that bitch down. <laughs> that That's the problem card right there. What you gonna grab? Defender? Well, that sucks. <laughs> At least not a... De no, that's not, it's not terrible. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. My, my detaches will still... Go. It's the graveyard. Give me that. You don't need it. I get vanished, and I'll just run you over and uh, set this thing to chain. <laughs> no. It's still still looking up for me. I think I think this might be it. I think he's out of resources. No. I should have played. That should have been my last turn play. See, I told you. If I finish chain that dancer. Yep. Yay! I won! Alright, we'll get another duel in. Be right back. Alright, we're back. So, yep, I have Calculus 3, then right after that, I have College Algebra. I also have a shitty hand right here. It's a really shitty hand. Wow. Wow, disgustingly bad hand. No, that is the one thing that I'm kind of worried about with this deck, is consistency. This is a normal monster deck? Yeah. Uh, I don't know what to do to help my consistency. I was grabbing the book. Yeah. All I need is one Deneb. Once I get the Deneb, man, it's, it's going down. But if I don't get the Deneb, then fuck. <laughs> so. There's only some time. Actually, I need any Teller Knight monster. Any Teller Knight monster. I was thinking about maybe running Pot or running like Unukula High or something to help me with the consistency. Yeah, I need some help. I need some help. I need to fix the deck and increase my consistency because this is not working. I need my consistency helped, cause God, look at this. I'm not drawing the shit. I'm, I'm literally might lose. I might lose this duel, cause he's summoning some big beaters. Oh well, big beater. I thought he was gonna summon another one and keep poking me. So all he has to do is keep poking me. I, I can't take much more of this. Come on, mm, come on. That is not what I need. Yeah, that is not what I need. All right. Uh, well, I'm having consistency issues right now, so. Yeah, maybe I should run a nuclear high. I took a nuclear high out, but you know, if I had a nuclear high right now, 
you know, maybe maybe you are supposed to run your nuclear high. I don't. I. I, I you know, it's great. He, he gets you set up early game, but late game doesn't do much. That's why I don't like him. So, oh. wait. Looks like I gotta run him, guys. God, this is bad. I have 23 left. I'm surprised my opponent hasn't just freaking ended me. Oh my God! Finally, a Deneb. Thank fucking Jesus. Thank you. Sorry, you got skill drain. <sighs> still might not not might be enough though. That's the funny thing. Depending on what my opponent does, he could probably still end me. You know what? It might be best if I go ahead and equip my my Deneb with us. I'll go up to two thousand and I'll be unaffected by my opponent's card effects. So that might be best if I go ahead and activate Alpha. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Damn, it's got compulse too. That's the problem. If he compulses me, then all he has to do is just poke me again. And I, don't, I wish I could get fucking Deneb to the graveyard, but he has fucking compulse. Damn, that sucks. Making me do plays that I really, really don't want to do. So you want to book a moon it? Go ahead. No, you got the book a moon. Saw you freaking search for it. Saw you get it. Ah. <sighs> And I was like anything but Capulse, like fuck. <sighs> you can't kill my Vega. That's fine. Can't even use my fiendish chains and shit. <laughs> Well, I know he has Book of Moon. Might be better to just go for a fucking Deltaros, to tell you the truth. Yeah. Summon you, summon you, XC into Deltaros. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. Hey, you want to Pokemon me? Go ahead. I'll go ahead and attack first. So, I know that's Pokemon face down. But is it better? Well, Deltaros is just blatantly just good. You know, even if he's face down, I should be okay. This is defense 21. That's still good. So there's no real point, real point in doing this because he's just got Chain Book of Moon. Like, That's fine. Oh, Chain Call of the Haunted. Okay, so you didn't set the Book of Moon. I mean, you're still destroyed, so it doesn't matter. Okay, well, we'll definitely be destroying that. So what are you, are you using like normal pendulums? I, I don't even know what deck you're using. That's, that, I, is that Book of Moon? Is that Book of Moon? I don't know, I'm destroying this. That's what I care about right now. Oh, Fiendish Chain, well that's awesome. <laughs> like one of the most useless cards right now. Here we go, Heart of the Underdog. Now wouldn't be the time to book a moon me. Let me tell you that right now. Now wouldn't be the time to book a moon me. Bad 
That was bad. That was really bad on your part. If you put me down, I could flip right back up. And then I could still attack. I could do like You literally just gave me an additional pop because you book a moon me. Like, that was bad. You shouldn't have done that. That was not the time to book a moon me. Poor Delta Rouse. He has no C materials. He's sad now. <laughs> anyway, I, uh... Oh! Soul Charge. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> well... Damn, he's summoning everything back. At least I have the Fiendish Chain to stop, you know, whatever he tries to kill me with. Because, you know, there's really no point in summoning all these monsters if you're not going to exceed with them. You know, they're not strong enough to get over me. So you, you want to exceed, but if, when you exceed, I'm going to Fiendish Chain you, but then you can also summon and exceed again. But at least you can't conduct your battle phase, so that's nice. No, I guess during this chain wasn't completely useless. Like, you can shut the fuck up while you're talking to me. Right now. <laughs> you can always summon another monster. Nope, you just, uh, I meant defeat. Nice! Nice! Even, I just did that didn't have and I came all the way back. I said, Teller Knights, they're pretty good at doing that. Alright, so I need to fix this next consistency issue, so. Uh. I can run pot. I can run Unukula High. I'm trying to think. We'll try. We'll try pot. Let's try pot first. All right, bear back. All right. Keep on getting distracted by the duels. Uh, uh, I took out Kage and I put in pot. So hopefully we'll go ahead and see the deck be just a little bit more consistent. You know, I don't expect to summon every turn, so it might be best to go ahead and just you know summon. There's not a Unukula High, but I'm just not a big fan of a Unukula High. I don't know why. I think I, I know why I know why I don't like him because once at, after an early game he's not that useful but you know I understand why you play him so I'll try pot and if pot doesn't help then a new clock I definitely will because we run you know call and oasis and warrior turning alive so there's a ton of shit that you know after we go ahead and send all right apparently nothing's happening oh let's say oh and, I, and then I get Rhoda like I said Rhoda you know that's all I need is to get get my consistency started. Is it a monster? Can you special summon it? Yep, there it is. Oh! You gonna lock down my fucking trap cards? Hello? <laughs> wow, all the rotas. All the rotas. Like, hello? Hello? All the rotas. That is fucking amazing. Summon you. I'm gonna take out that that Jinzo Jacker. Yes. No. Summon you. Yes. Get my search on. I might put him back to the deck actually. Yeah, give me you. And uh, who do I want to? Who can handle this? Castell can handle this situation just fine. Just fine. Yep. Cast out. Cast out. Spin back the Jacker. Because I would really like my Oasis still. And also I want to get the Nab to the Graveyard. How Ginger Jacker has a big old booty. Put that back. And run over him. So my online classes are my education classes. You know, I'm trying to still be... Still trying to become a teacher, so... You know, I still got them education classes. So, uh, the first one is Education 220, which is Principle of Educational Psychology. There's a four credit class. It's, that's the biggest credit class out of all of them, so it's probably the most difficult. So, yeah. And then my other class is uh, Education 280, which is Value in Cultural Diversity. You would think that that's just that should be a lesson. Like, I need an entire class to learn cultural diversity. Like, like I'm black, you know? <laughs> and I, and, you know, I'm black, but I listen to Korean music, but I watch Japanese anime. <laughs> like, I'm all over the place, like, <laughs> so, you know, I totally mind that. And, yeah, that's it. That's all the classes I have this semester. Alright, well, I am definitely going to be, uh, Delta Rossing that card right there. 
Oh, Alpha. I love that card. So, so far, I haven't got Pot or... Yeah. I did that wrong. I did that wrong. Yep, did that wrong. Did that hella wrong. Why did I fuck up? Ah. Uh, trying to think now. I'm trying to think what I should do. <laughs> I meant to go summon Vega, but I accidentally clicked on you. If I summon you, then I, uh, if I would have activated Rota first, maybe I would have had something. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I fucked up. I misclicked and I am punished. Punish me for I know not what I have done. <laughs> now I gotta burn one of my cards. I'll burn Oasis, is okay. Ah, damn it. I didn't want to do that. No, no. I'm not gonna equip, uh, equip, uh, equip. Oh, I could've went to Triv. Ah, oh, it's okay. Should have could have given me my oasis back, but it's okay. I'm not going to Delta Ross. God, I fucked up. I can always go into Triv later. Yay, fuck your giant rat. Damn it, damn it, damn it. That upsets me. I wish I would have activated the road of fur. I got anything else to search for? Yeah. Another one of you. I always like having you. Alright, go ahead. Alright, let's see what my punk does. They surrender. Alright. <laughs> Alright. Well, that's it. So, I'm ready to go back. Ready to go back. I'm ready to, you know, do some math. Okay, that's literally um, math and online classes. That's what this semester is. So I hope the online classes workloads not too much for me. You know, I only go to class Tuesdays and Thursdays. So you know, Mondays and Wednesdays, it's gonna be pretty much just recording videos for you guys and you know, doing my stuff that I gotta do online on my online classes. Hopefully, it's not too much. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Uh, be sure to ch uh, you know, check out tomorrow. There will be a webcam duel going up tomorrow, so I know how much you guys like that series. The first episode went really well, so it's time to get to you guys another second episode. So um, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow using uh, Cleese. Alright guys, thanks for watching.